welcome to 10 Minutes with Toastmasters. We are a nonprofit, membership driven organization that promotes speaking and leadership skills. My name is Doris and I'm welcoming Josh. Hi, Josh. Hi, Doris. How are you? I'm great this evening. Thanks great. for having me. Great. Thanks for being here. Share with me how you learned about Toastmasters. I learned about Toastmasters through my friend Dana Flumerfeld. And she is, I believe, the current VP of. She's the area. She's the area director, but she's also right. an officer in our club. I believe uh, she's membership. Public relations, I believe. Yes. yes. And at the time, she was telling me about Toastmasters, and to me, it sounded like the geekiest thing in the world. <laughs> just the ge absolute geekiest thing in the world. And not that I'd be opposed to anything like that, I just mm. thought I had better things to do with my time. Right. It was, I believe, January of 2017 that she and the rest of the club hosted a Speechcraft program, which right. is a six-week intensive that highlights the major principles of mm. Toastmasters. I took that program thinking I would just shut her up and <laughs> fell in love with the idea of self-improvement at one's own personal pace. Right. And all of the other principles right. that the club promotes. Right, that's a great description because you do go at your own pace. Yes. Uh, but you've been progressing quite a lo quite a long from what I've seen, right? You've done quite a few speeches. I Yes, I have. I've done a lot. Mm -hmm. I've done a lot. And it's one of those things where I want to get the most out of it as quickly as I can. Right, And right. that's the pace that I want to go exactly. at, where other members will do a speech a year, and that's perfectly okay. Right. Perfectly okay, that that's mm. the pace that they want to right. proceed at. So this pretty much uh, got you excited to progress and move forward once you had joined. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It was, was... it was a lot of fun, and it still is a lot of fun, and I don't think anybody would ever come to a meeting and not see us laugh right. throughout the whole meeting. Mm -hmm. And it's so great that it's a environment where you can show up and fail forward. And that's right. the idea of it, mm -hmm. is you are presenting in front of people who are there to support you in your development. So right. you can develop your communication skills. Mm -hmm. That's what else I really like about Toastmasters is that it's not just public speaking. Mm -hmm. And that's one of the things that describes Toastmasters right away. But I like to think of it more as communication. Right. Because not only are you learning how to speak, you're learning mm -hmm. how to stand. Right. You're learning how to sit. You're learning mm -hmm. how to use your hands. Right. To use pauses in your sentences for effectiveness. Right. Vocal variety. Exactly. So many different on. skills in mm. terms of communication right. are promoted there. And I believe communication is probably our most important skill that mm. we can have, whether we're communicating verbally or physically right. or with the written word. I think it's really yeah. important for us to all have the ability to communicate well. I agree. I agree, but yeah. So is there a specific role that resonates with you when you go to the meetings? I don't know if there's a, a specific role that resonates. I love table topics. I love grammarian. I'm really challenged by timer, the role of timer. Mm. Each, of the, each of the speeches, each of the segments of the club are timed. Yes. There's an agenda from start to finish. Right. Each of the portions of the meeting, from speeches to evaluations, mm -hmm. all have times. Somebody needs to be in charge of timing <laughs> them. And it challenges me because I'm very easily distracted, I find. Mm -hmm. When you have somebody's speech that's supposed to last five to seven minutes. Right. And you're timing that speech. You have to time it at the very beginning correctly. Right. You have to pay attention to the time as you go through. Mm -hmm. As you're cueing the speaker that there's a certain right. amount of time left mm -hmm. for them to use up in their speech. It's a lot more difficult than one would think. Right. It is difficult because all of a sudden you could go off on a different topic as you were talking about your speech. And then it's, well, how do I come back to the main point and wrap it up? Because I'm now noticing that I've got about a minute left, right? Right. right. It does take some skill there. Mm -hmm. But you're there to learn. You're aware of it, which I think is the beauty in itself. Yes. 
Right. Yes, and it's it's a great social aspect mm -hmm. too, where right. you have friends that are there. You make friends with people mm -hmm. that show up because they're interested in improving something about themselves. It doesn't necessarily right. have to be speaking, mm -hmm. but they're there because they're interested in improving, mm -hmm. as well as supporting everybody else that's part of the club. Right, I agree. In fact, one of the roles that I really love is the evaluator. Being able to provide constructive criticism back to somebody in an effective, non-judgmental, non-disrespectful way. It's mm -hmm. just, let me make sure that this is what I got from the speech. And that does take skill. Mm -hmm. It's not easy to share what your thoughts are in a speech, especially if you had difficulty understanding what the message was. Correct. Yeah. One of the most supporting parts of mm. Toastmasters, our club anyways, yes. is when everybody speaks, everybody in the club gives feedback, and we do so with the sandwich method. And yes. The sandwich method is something where, as you're providing people feedback, you provide them one thing that you liked about their speech or their right. presentation. A compliment. A compliment. The first layer of bread in the sandwich, if yes. you will. Then mm -hmm. the filling of the sandwich is where they could improve on something. Mm -hmm. And then the bottom part of the sandwich is another part that you loved or appreciated yeah. about the speech. And I find that a very effective way to provide feedback to people. Absolutely. It encourages I mean, them, but it right. also gives them an area where they can pay attention to. Right. I've even found that skill in that I hired a contractor to do work for me, and I wasn't overly pleased with the job, and I thought, well, how am I going to handle this? And so I made sure that I complimented it on something specific, provided the feedback of, well, I thought it was going to turn out to be differently than what it looks like. And then I still ended with, but I'm really happy with the results of how everything went. It was still able, I was still able to bring that message across, and it wasn't as harsh as it probably would have been had I not gone through a Toastmasters experience myself. Sure. Yeah. Is there anything else that resonates with you with Toastmasters? I love the fact that people can come to the meetings and just try it out. Right. You know, it is a club, so there are dues when you do decide to become a member. Right. But until that point, you can come to as many meetings as you'd like just to see right. what it's like. Yep. So that's what I would like to leave people with is mm. where we meet and when we meet can all be found right. online on our Facebook page. Yeah. But come and check out a meeting. See how it operates. See how it goes. So you can just sit in the back and participate if you'd like to, but you right. don't have to at no all. No obligation. You don't have to at all. Right. I agree. And then once you are a member, you can go to any club. Yes. and partake if you'd like. Um, but I, that's the concept that I truly love as well, is that you can just show up, take it all in, visit as often as you'd like. You could decide it's really not for me. You could say, well, actually, maybe maybe it is, but I'm not really feeling comfortable about this. And right. great, that's why we're there to help you and support you. So um, it's a great message for sure. Well, I appreciate your time today. This has been great. Thank you for having me. Thanks. This has been Temis with Toastmasters. If you're curious to learn more about our organization, feel free to visit us at toastmasters.org. Mm -hmm.